Okay, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. And today I'm really happy to come back and, and to talk about the uh, uh, Ubuntu on the window that uh, allow you to use uh, Ubuntu terminal and run Ubuntu command input base as git, apt, and many more about the command in Ubuntu. And as you can see, this is the Ubuntu uh, 18.04 LTS. As you can see, yeah, uh, this is a command line activity that you can use it to uh, learn about the Ubuntu terminal command line and while you use seeing window and you can go to uh, Microsoft Store to download Ubuntu here and you can search and download it and for me I uh, just uh, installed it but how to run and choose it okay the first thing you need to do is install from the Microsoft Store and after download it you can launch it but one thing you need to know is uh, uh, we need to enable Windows subsystem for the component on the Windows 10 because uh, uh, in the Windows 10 we need to enable it so you can uh, go in to this uh, website for uh, more detail if you don't know how to install uh, you follow my guide in this video okay just enable it so what you need to do to enable it just uh, one thing you need to go is about the uh, stuff and then sitting will bring you to here and what you need to go to next is you find out the update and scroll here and you will see the menu for the web volume and you need to click it and what the next thing you need to do is uh, uh, you need to click the uh, developer mode tab and then you uh, the developer will be asking you about the turn on developer mode so you can click yes and wait if you install more click it Let's wait a little bit. Because this will auto install from the internet. So it depends on your internet connection. For me, uh, my internet is very slow, I think. Because uh, as you can see, it's still loading and installing developer mode package. So, Okay, so now uh, the web mode packet installed and we move through for the stuff is new and about now and about. So uh, the next thing you need to do is go into press comma uh, window run window one and to tie this optional feature dot exe and then 
enter and you will show like this and what you need to do is scroll down and you will see the here window here window subsystem for Linux and click it and then you need to click OK After that, you need to restart your uh, window complete to the chain. For me, I don't need to restart it. After that, um, get back to the store and launch it again. It's still like this because we need to restart it. Okay, let's wait a minute and um, restart it. Okay, now as the restart, and um, go into my software again, and uh, go to uh, my Windows and click launch, and you will see the installing may take a few minutes because now uh, we run on the first time, so we need to install some package on the uh, Windows. So just wait a little bit. Okay, now uh, you need to put a uh, new username for log into the uh, our Linux. So you can say, uh, uh, I can say, uh, and meaning for the root something. Okay, uh, the, because uh, root user is already easy, so we need to put another one I can say admin oh admin is already used to you can just uh, I can say uh, root and describe admin ok and you can put your password Okay. So now you walk in and you can see the command. So you can test with your language command. You can say uh we a file. You can say Reset to be seen. Okay, it's very nice. You know, you can erase. Oh, yes, it's very really great. Okay, thanks for watching. And uh, uh, you need any question, you can ask me below this video. And for the how to choose command line you will see the next video I will uh, show you more about uh, how to use a uh, basic uh, turn lock on my watch with Linux so see you in the next video if you like don't forget to subscribe to a lot more the video to get the new video soon and like it share and like thank you goodbye